Once upon a time, there was a young girl. Her name was Princess Elizabeth. Her parents, the king and queen, thought and thought and thought about what to give their daughter for her birthday. I have just the gift for her, said the queen. We shall give Elizabeth her very own village in our kingdom. So when Princess Elizabeth's birthday arrived, the king and queen gave the news. Hear ye, hear ye, from this day forth, the kind and cheerful and very smart Princess Elizabeth shall rule Olive Mountain. She will rule wisely and love her people, and her people will love her. So begins Princess Elizabeth Solves the Big Problem by Patty O'Donohue, a whimsical fairy tale that showcases children's instincts for problem solving while investigating the benefits of thinking about familiar things in a new way. You see, the princess quickly realizes there is a problem on Olive Mountain. It turns out the subjects of Olive Mountain are fed up with olives which they must eat to follow the kingdom's ancient royal rule. In fact, the princess discovers that all the people in the kingdom from Cucumber City to Turkey Town are tired of eating the same thing day after day. Follow this charming story to discover the unique ideas brought forth by the princess that not only made the kingdom happy, but also made the king and queen very proud. Princess Elizabeth Solves the Big Problem by Patty O'Donoghue. 